Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Austin and today is day two of the boys week. Today is Tuesday, day two. I'm doing videos on the boys every day this week, Monday through Friday. And today on day two, I'm going to be reacting to the thrill, thrilling, thrill ride album. I don't know exactly what it's called. I think it's thrilling, but the single is thrill ride, I think. Um, I bought three versions of it, so I'm going to unbox that really quick, and then we're going to listen to the songs. If you're new to my channel, consider subscribing. Check out my The Boys playlist for more The Boys videos, and uh, yeah, I would love to have you here. You can turn your notifications on, too, uh, so you don't miss out on The Boys, you know, day three, day four, all that stuff, and still send me suggestions. I'm still looking for suggestions for other The Boys videos to react to this week, so let me go ahead and start this unboxing. Um, I do want to say really quick before I do the unboxing, I ordered from Choice Music LA. I did a pre-order um, because I didn't really care about getting it like as soon as it released. I wasn't like obsessed with The Boys yet, um, but they included some really cute like pre-order like bonus cards or whatever. And uh, I'm gonna show those to you. If you're following me on Twitter, I already posted these. Go follow me on Twitter so that you can see what I'm doing. But yeah, these are really gorgeous. And then they gave me also a couple like extra little photo cards. I love it when you get free freebies, even though they're not like official. Block my face. It's always nice just getting something. There we go. All right, so now I'm gonna unbox the album. I got the three different colors or the three different version photo books. I don't know if there's like a jewel case version of that, but if there is, I did not buy it. <laughs> All right, so this is the blue and green version. It is really pretty. There's like a gradient, like it's going from blue to green. Okay, oh, I see two photo cards. Uh, I'm still learning their names, so oh my gosh, you're gonna have to tell me who I got. You're gonna have to tell me who I got. Got him. And him. Wow, okay. And then. Do, 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 do. I'm not sure what this is, but let me just take a look at the album really quick. Oh, wow. This might be like a night version, maybe? Because all of the photo, oh my goodness. Because all of the photos are like, Nighttime, like carnival. I don't even know, like, the names of the different... Oh my gosh, there's more stuff! Hold on. There's, there's definitely more stuff. Oh, I got a ticket. Oh. Here is the ticket that I got. Jacob. Love that. What is this? Oh my gosh. Oh, is this, who is this? Okay, and then this is like a, it's kind of, oh, it's not gonna show up on camera. It's like a, I don't know what it's called, like a holographic, not holographic, but it like changes when you move it. Got some cute stickers, rainbow, ghost, dinosaur. Super random. And I got a very gorgeous photo. Oh my gosh. Gorgeous. So pretty. The boys' visuals. Like, 
I'm sorry, I don't know like all of their names and stuff yet. I just reacted to the guide yesterday and uh, it's gonna take me a minute to get all of their names down. But like, this is gorgeous. And the album is really nice. It's, um, it's obviously a book. It's like the, the photo book version, but it's, it's not like SM photo books lately. It's a little bit more like, I feel like it would stand up a little bit better in your shelf, if that makes sense. Um, whereas a lot of the newer photo books are just, they're just really thin and they just feel super cheap, but this one doesn't feel as cheap. So yeah. All right, now I'm gonna open the pink version. It's like hot pink and like another pink. This happened when I opened, when I did my NCT unboxings too. <laughs> like, I unboxed a bunch of NCT albums and I didn't, I had no idea what was happening. I didn't know the people's names. I was just obsessed with the music. Uh, and then I went and I looked back and I got like a ton of like Jaehyun photo cards and those are like super rare. So we'll see. All right. Whose ticket did I get? Julian, oh, oh wow, he's got his eyebrow pierced, wow. That's gorgeous. That's really the only word I can say for this, like, this is stunning. Wow. These are really nice. I love this. And then, oh, this one's pink. Ooh, cutie with the heart glasses. Oh, come on, focus. Love that. If you want to, like if you want to, if you're bored. Oh, I didn't even notice. It also comes with like a, a wristband you can put around your wrist. That's awesome. If you're bored, you can like timestamp the photo cards I got and let me know. Oh God, they're wearing shorts. He's got, hold on, hold on. Let me show you what I'm looking at just a second. Oh, and the CD for this one is pink too. Oh, Jesus, okay. Oh, there's only one photo card in this one. Oh no, there's two, okay. If you like thighs, um, <laughs> get the pink version because they're all wearing shorts. And it's just, I looked at a couple of the pages and it's just all thighs. Uh, so, uh, yeah, yeah, if, 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 if you're into that, uh, it's just, oh, look at that basketball. It's like encrusted with jewels. <clears throat> this version is kind of dangerous, not gonna lie. All right, and the photo cards I got. Oh, wow, okay, hold on. Uh, wanna make sure I don't get any dupes. No, it's not a duplicate. All right, we're gonna start with uh, <laughs> this photo card. Oh, come on. Love that. <laughs> Love that for me. Uh, and then I got one of his photo cards already, I think. This is a different one, though. All right. Going through this pretty quick. This is the green and yellow one. I'm just really excited to check out the music because so far I love all, like every song from the boys I've listened to is on my phone. I love all of them. Especially Sun Wu. Like, ah, the boys' rap is so good. And I know I always talk about that. You're probably annoyed hearing me talk about their rap every single time, but it's just so good. All right. And I got 
Eric. All right. Oh, I love this. Ugh. All right. Oh, man. The boys, the boys, the boys. This is the beginning of something, you guys. It's probably going to fall down. Fall down this rabbit hole. Thanks for encouraging me. Oh, I didn't even... Wait. I didn't talk about the other version. The other version was like, um... Thighs. And like... <laughs> tropical. Alright, my photo cards... Wow, I didn't get any duplicate photo cards, so that's awesome. My first one... Oh, his smile. Ugh. Get out of here. So cute. And then this one is... Looks like this is like the fruity version. Not as in like homosexual, as in like a... Like a fruit. Okay, we got... We got some more thighs. But yeah, like, he's eating a watermelon. Oh. There's some unnecessary, like, tongue going on there. Uh, this is pretty disrespectful. Um, I think... Whichever photo book version you get. Uh, oh, he, okay. He's just not wearing a shirt at all. Great, love that. <laughs> Why did I buy this? <laughs> Ugh. Okay, I'm, I'm done. I just gotta show you this one last one. He, yep, just hanging out. And then uh, over here, just being cute. <laughs> okay. All right, this is going to be a problem. Uh, hold on, let me put all this stuff back together, and then we will listen to the album. Pray for me. All right, so we are starting with Out of Control. I'm skipping Thrill Ride because, obviously, like I've been listening to that a ton since it came out. So I'm going to skip that. Let's just do Out of Control. There's so many people on the screen. We're just starting off with Sunwoo. What's this chorus gonna sound like? Oh! I wasn't expecting it to go up like that. I think Sunwoo has had the most lines so far. I love that. Oh. Oh. 
This is so different. Kevin on the bridge. Wow, this melody is really interesting. Oh. That sounded so pretty. Okay. Oh, okay. Um, it's hard. It's hard for me to put into words exactly what I mean, like what I'm trying to say. But that song was really good. It it sounded like the boys like it's hard it's hard to explain but they have their own sound like you know it's the boys song when you're listening to them and that i don't know i don't know how to explain it it was very summery it was very fun i thought it was going to be kind of darker but then that chorus hit and i was just like oh and then i still wasn't sure it just it grows on you that's a song that i like and i'm sure that's going to be a song that i love like the more I listen to it more and more, but yeah, that's good. First, this is, that's actually the first ever B side I've ever listened to from the boys. So it's really interesting. All right. All right. Next up is dancing till we drop. And I know this is going to be good. You can't call a song that and it not be a bop. So let's go. I'm excited. Oh, Okay, funky bass. The vocals are so smooth. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, that run. Let's get it on. I really like news voice. Oh, I love this. Oh, is this whole album going to be this fun? Oh, 
Wait. Oh, okay. That was really good. Um, what am I trying to say? The, the music is complex, but it's also catchy. I'm trying to say that like it's super catchy and it's super fun without sounding generic. It definitely sounds poppy, and I really like that, and it's really fun but it's also like really intricate and the melodies are super complex and the vocals are really freaking good. And Sunwoo and Eric are like killing it for me. Like I love them, but like, I also really love news voice. Um, so far the one, the voices that have stood out to me the most are new Jacob, Kevin, and then Sunwoo and Eric are definitely my favorite. Like, <laughs> I just love the boys' rap energy. Like, it's just so good. Um, but yeah, the, this is good. I like this. All right, next up is called Nightmares. I wonder if this is going to be like a darker song. Um, let's go. Oh. Oh. Hold on. Does Sunwoo just start every single song? Like, I think he might be my bias. Like, I love him, but like, all right, let's just go. Uh, someone told me that he helps write a lot of the songs. So like, I don't know. Is it... I'm only two songs in, but so far the line distribution... It... There's just so many members. There's just a couple that aren't getting that many lines, and I feel bad. Oh, cute. Oh. oh, these lyrics. Oh. This is my favorite one so far. Eric. I love this. Ah. 
It's so pretty and so haunting. Oh, those vocals. What was that? That thrill ride, like, are we at like a haunted carnival? Because <laughs> like, I love that. I love that. It's almost spooky season. I'm a November baby. So like, yes, yes to all of that. Um, That's my favorite song on the album so far. It's just different. It's unique, but it's still, I don't, I don't know. I, I the boys kind of like are making me speechless because like it's just good <laughs> and I can't I don't know why I just like it all right all right next up is Merry Bad Ending this better not be a freaking Christmas song I hate Christmas music um but like the title's still kind of like creepy so like maybe we're I, I don't know let's just let's go Oh. Interesting. Is he, Chu Hyun, is he like kind of a rapper too? Because like he always kind of comes in with a little bit of flow too. The vocal layering. Libs in the back. Uh, 
Ugh. Man, I don't think I said anything like that whole song. <laughs> that... That was just good. I... Okay, that was just good. All right, this is B-O-Y, Bet On You. And uh, I got kind of confused for a second because I guess they also have like a title track called B-O-Y, uh, which I have not reacted to yet. But there's a music video, so I will react to that one at some point this week. Uh, but this is Bet On You. Let's go. Oh, I like this instrumental. Hey. I like how chill this is. Oh, Kevin's voice is so nice. Wow, those vocals on the back. That's it. Oh, no. That song was so short. No. <laughs> that song was too short. That album is too short. Okay, I guess it's like an EP or like a mini album or whatever. Um, okay. How do I feel about this mini album? I like it. It's kind of experimental. It's very fun. It's very upbeat. It's very positive. I don't know how to say it without sounding like I didn't like it because I did like all of the songs. But what I want to say is that I liked all of the songs on the album, but I don't like any of the songs as much as I like the other title tracks. Does that make sense? Like Giddy Up and Reveal and No Air and Bloom Bloom and The Stealer and Breaking Dawn. Like, I love all of those songs so much. And I've listened to all of those songs at least like a hundred times a piece. And I can't see myself liking any of the songs on this album, including Thrill Ride, as much as I like those other albums, those other songs. So, it's not a bad thing. Out of this album, uh, Nightmares is definitely my favorite. I love, I love that song. But, yeah, I mean, that's normal. That's totally normal. Even, like, with EXO and stuff, there's some albums that I like a little bit more than other albums. 
with Mamamoo, there's some albums I like better than... It's totally normal. Um, but I did like this. This is my first of the boys album I've ever listened to. So I didn't know what to expect. Um, they can't all be title tracks, but I don't know. I, I still have to emphasize I liked every song on this album. So it's good. And I know that there's going to be some of these songs that are going to grow on me even more and more the more that I listen to them. So that was day two of the boys week. Um, I'm really excited to see some of the live stages from them because that's where they really shine is what I've been told. Um, and the guide that I reacted to it really hyped up the live stages. So I'm either going to do music videos I haven't seen yet tomorrow or live stages. I haven't decided which yet, but still leave me suggestions in the comments. Let me know what you want me to react to this week and I will see you next time. Bye.